started there, we played in a nightclub. We yeah. played uh, Bob Dylan, Jimmy Hendrix, uh, the Rolling Stones. Yeah. Then we made Calcutta 16. Yeah. It lasted for a short time, but we did cut 145. Yeah. Which you know. This one I know. May you let me know uh, how you get uh, the opportunity to uh, let it press on the uh, issue on EMI, EMI? I have no clue. Okay, okay. Me also. Okay. I have no clue. Yeah. But somehow they became interested yeah. to record it. Okay, so they came to you? They came to us. gentleman by the name of Mr. Oscar Menon, who was a visionary. Yeah. He was EMI, okay. big boss. Yeah. And he, because of him, yeah. every single album yeah. which was released in the West yeah. was available in Calcutta yeah. within one month. Okay. Everything, Sergeant Pepper's Hearts of Man, everything came within one month. Yeah. So he was a visionary and somehow he must have thought that these young kids, yeah. they are doing something interesting, yeah. so yeah. why not give it a chance. Okay. So Calcutta 16, we cut one album, one uh, 45. So you have been living here at Calcutta 16? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I guess, huh? 
Ten tracks, yeah. all written. Okay. All written by Dylan. Still available in the CD? I like to look at it. I don't know whether it's available in the shops because it's sold out. The first printing. For sure. For sure. This it sold out, yeah. and HMB did not make another printing. Yeah. But I'm sure it's on YouTube. Okay. Uh, on YouTube it is. I know. I Get a live with no delays on it because he died in 90. Okay, okay. But all his songs yeah. done very faithfully. Yeah. No changing the arrangement or anything. Okay. Just digital remaster. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now let me uh, summarize the match about the early years because I'm very interested in late 60s, early 70s. And a Kaka 60 for me, the B side, not uh, Mr. Purple, the other side is most amazing. I don't know why I don't get it in the moment. Beautiful song. It was best for her, for example. Dave Dance. He was fantastic. Very he was good. Yeah. He was the man yeah. who actually inspired us yeah. to do the music. Okay. That we yeah. And he doesn't play bass anymore, but he lives in England. And I'm still kind of on that. Okay. Best greetings from me. So. And did you have any contact with the uh, band from Mumbai, for example? Yeah, like yeah, Savages yeah. or whatever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Savages. Yeah. 